in Am I the Asshole News? Always. Submitted by Homelian Costco. <laughs> Jomali and Costco? Yeah. Oh, okay. <laughs> A vegan called the police on her friends who fed her chicken as a prank. Oh, that's oh, fucked that's up. That's mean, but... She could have yeah. got sick. Oh, that she called the police? Uh, they're both fucked up. Oh, they're both up. fucked yeah. up, yeah. yeah. I think it's fucked up she didn't Extreme have enough protein. Extreme reaction to, like, a mean thing that happened. Yeah. That's almost like vegan blasts her friend in the face after being yeah. fed chicken, and it's like, maybe you didn't have to kill yeah, your friend? Yeah, that would be extreme. So this part, because, I don't know, a lot of people actually agreed with her. So this is the story on Reddit. It's, am I the asshole for going to the police over a prank? So she starts, to preface this, I- It's kind of funny though. <laughs> I, 24 year old female, am vegan and have been for a good 10 years. I have not eaten meat since I was roughly three to four years old Whoa. when I found out where meat comes from, parentheses, spoiler alert, there were a lot of tears. This, this is no- We get it. <laughs> this is no secret and everyone in my life knows and respects this, or so I thought. Four nights ago, I was at a party and I will admit I got white girl wasted. My friends thought it would be funny to feed me chicken nuggets as a prank. I checked with them before chowing down, are these vegan? To which my friends replied, yeah, they're sun fed, a uh, type of vegan chickenless chicken. Uh, they tasted they tasted off to me, but I figured it was just because I was drunk. I was wrong. I found out the next day when my sister sent me a message telling me to check my friend's Snapchat story. The story was them showing the nugget packaging and then showing then showing them giving them to me, including the conversation where I asked if it was vegan. Uh, then it's fucked up! It's really fucked up. That's then, fucking stupid. Yeah, it's and just like a trust. Them mocking me and oh. pretending to be uh, pretending to be me when I found out I ate meat. Oh, they're things, bitches. Yeah. Like, Those aren't friends. Nuh uh. Things like fake crying and yelling, the chickens! I took a screen recording. Those are bullies. They're yeah, bad. what the fuck? <laughs> I took a screen recording of the video and took it to the police on the grounds of food tampering, and now three of my ex friends are facing charges. Go girl! They, they all think that I'm overreacting to a harmless prank. So Reddit, am I the asshole? In my view, they took advantage of my drunken state, tampered with my food, and publicly humiliated me. I would have just- In their view, it was just a prank. Yeah. I, I would have just got him back. I would have fucking spit in something or and then off in their food. Yeah, but and then they're like, you. that's kung fu! <laughs> it's, it's harmless, why are you overcome? Like, why are you getting mad? But she could actually get really sick yeah. from that. Where you can't from get meat? sick from eating cum. Yeah, if you're a vegan and you haven't had meat yeah, your body's not oh, used to processing. Yeah, yeah. She, she did really say sick. that she had been throwing up a lot That's the true. next morning, but she does admit that it could have, like, it could have just yeah, been- She seems pretty level-headed. Um, like, at first it sounded like, I'm what? I'm calling the cops! Yeah. But that seems like- And also, guess what? That's why you don't motherfucking bully people. Yeah. You know, bullies, they hurt, they learned a lesson the hard way. Yeah. But you bet your ass they're not gonna be mean a, no more. A friend thing is like, like even if it was a mean prank and I like gave you chicken, afterwards be like, oh, that was real chicken, ha huh? we got oh, you. And then so you're like, good. oh no, I feel bad. I'm like, oh, sorry, like no, it was so just sorry, a prank so or what, I'm so sorry, like it was just a prank. Not like I'm doing it behind your back and doing a Snapchat thing and then mocking you and while you're drunk and throwing up over there. That's yeah. fucking sucks. Should have gave him no. dog or something. Like her to them? Yeah. What do you buy happen? dog? But she's veget she's vegan. She why would she support that? Well, I don't know. You probably have to go to like Asia or someplace or something. Oh, that's an yeah. expensive prank. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I do it. To get yeah, even, prank. I'll be like, oh, you wanna laugh at me, motherfucker? After I told you that shit, them my getting charges. I love how you're gonna go against your own thing. <laughs> how huh? much is like food contamination I'll, I'll, charge? With them, it's like a federal offense. Cause remember when they were doing the licking the ice cream thing? It was huge. Oh, oh, shit. Food tampering. Is Going to the cops? Is it fair for me? Like, would that be enough for you? Where no. you're like, I got my revenge. No, I need them to be mentally traumatized so they understand what it feels like. Then you should feed them human. I made you eat your parents. That's, I made you yeah, eat your parents. That's awesome. See, that's that's the way I get even. Because it's yeah, like the weird part is like you uh, going going to the cops. That's a criminal offense. But then when you have an issue between friends, I don't know if I would go. They're to not the friends cops. anymore. Yeah, they're not. And you like street like law. You go by street rule code. Yeah. No, I want mentally they traumatizing rule. Like, like, that's street that. code. Yeah, then, yeah, then <laughs> fuck like, them, fuck them up, and, and leave the cops out of it. Yeah, beat the shit out of them in the garage. What's right, but she's not going street code. Really? 
they're just facing charges, right? It's gonna yeah, go away. Yeah, tempering, yeah. It's not, nothing is as satisfying as a, and as good as to traumatize someone. To scare them. But then what if We're it fucks with their something? job? Huh? What if it fucks with their job? Bye, you're a bad person. Their reputation might be big. They yeah. should have thought about that How before. No, no, I'm saying for him. I'm saying for him, yeah. like if it, if, because for him he's like, they're not traumatized, but I'm like, it could fuck up their life. Oh, you mean the charges? Yeah. yeah. Oh, gotcha. I mean, yeah, nothing is as, Life fuckery as as a trauma that they have to <laughs> live with the Dude, fact. Look, that this is uh, one of the comments said, "Cancel the friendship, but drop charges. It's not worth ruining someone's life over this." Like, no, like fuck no. It drop ain't. charges and ruin their lives mentally, so mm -hmm. they live with the fact that they did something. That's like, hey man, you don't fuck with this. How old are they? I, she says she's 24. I don't know. Or anymore. get them the, the 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 thing that they don't like to eat. Like, oh, they hate broccoli. You know? Shit, that's not true. And then they make them eat it, and you're like, you ate broccoli. No, no. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I don't know if I would go as far as saying it's food tampering either, because it's not like at a business where you're fucking with people's. It's like a personal space, you know. Like if yeah. if I tell my mom I don't like onions. And she puts extra onions into my whatever I'm making. I'm not like food tampering. That's like it's just, yeah. What's no. the definition no, 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 of food tampering? At this point, she asked, and she she asked, and they mm. confirmed. Yes, it is. That's fine. a big. Difference. Oh, that's yeah, true. That's, that's, but it's still between two non-consensual like, meat eating. Exactly. Yeah, but it's still between. I don't know. If, when it comes to friends and family, it's 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 hard for me to bring rules that are meant for like outside society in. I think it's, it's like, like my mom, like, get off my property. I told you, this is my property line. If you go check with the city, you'll know at this longitude, it's like my mom would be like, what the fuck are you talking about? Mm -hmm. Are we friends and family or, or not? I think the liability is like if like if I have a peanut allergy and I, mm -hmm. if I ask them like, is there peanuts in this? And they know that there's in it, but then they want to see me react. Yeah. Yeah, it's there were, like I think I recently saw something about like a kid that was facing charges because he's trying to kill like, Somebody with or not penis. kill, but like they were trying to get some. Oh, it's with the teacher, yeah. right? It was like banana or something. Oh yeah, bananas. That's yeah, what it was. Yeah. You remember? But that's like assault with a deadly weapon. Almost. Teacher? Hmm? A kid so was the, trying to kill a teacher? Well, so like the teacher was like deathly allergic to bananas, and as a joke. They yeah, that's true. Because the girl's not deathly allergic to chicken. It's so a preference. It's, it's a preference to her. They don't know that. Yeah. They don't know. They don't know. Yeah. 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 And what if that chicken gave her some like meat virus because yeah. her body's not immune to it? And then she died. And you two guys don't miss out on any more episodes of Just Kidding. So make sure that you're subscribed. Make like, sure you're subscribed yeah. so you know all the details of bananas and allergies. Yes. <laughs> so you don't get chicken snuck into your food. So people on Reddit are saying they support her, that she's not an asshole for doing it? The majority of the people pretty much concluded like she's not, yeah, you know how they do a little mm -hmm. thing, it's not an asshole. I think if the friends were like, my bad, apologized, left it at that. Exactly. And yeah. then she called the cops, I think she would have been an asshole. But yeah. they didn't do that. Yeah, they actually posted but, it yeah. and like I, made fun and of it. Yeah, yeah, and I think being mocked pushes people to their limits. Yeah. Cause it's like, motherfucker, I try to level with you. Now it's revenge time, mm -hmm. bitch. And I go, it doesn't sound like she was there and like called the cops at the party. It sounds like the next yeah, day she saw nice. it and was like, I'm gonna drive to the police station yeah. and see what I can do about this because I feel so violated. And apparently the cops saw that, like there was there was grounds for this cause they did press we charges. We have the video, can we watch it? <laughs> really it's see anonymous. It. A bunch of asses, man. Yeah, that's fucked up. What kind of? What kind of people, what kind of friends do people Young have? people need to learn that there's consequences for bullying. That's like a They're college kids? in our society. Yeah. That's when you make your mistakes. Like, guess what? A lot of people got maybe. DUIs and shit in college. It's like, these people get chicken felonies. You know what? I, I don't know, like, um... <laughs> do that shit again. They learn their lesson. I'm wondering if I should face criminal charges for all the mistakes that I've made as a young person because of how stupid I was. Well, yeah, you did breaking and entering and, and burglary. So well, maybe. those I agree with. <laughs> I, I pretty, I'm pretty sure those laws, but then this, some of the other gray area bullying yeah. things like this, right? Like, it's like, I don't know, isn't that a normal part of being young and stupid? And then like you get you don't get to in these day and age. Maybe. Yeah, in this day but and age. In college. It's like when people put, okay, what do you think about this gray area? When someone puts a drug in your drink that you didn't know, like, you know, you didn't know you were drinking drugs, you didn't. You thought you were drinking a soda, and they put ecstasy in there or whatever. Did I have what a good time? To me? See, how'd you feel? I think I'm also not scared. the culture's different yeah. though. Like, in our, when, when we were younger, there's so much more, like, uh, gray area and, like, grace period. Whereas now, I think, especially with everyone having a specific identity, like, I'm vegan, then this is a huge strike on them and it hurts them a lot. Versus, I think, if we were in high school, 
Um, everyone knew I didn't smoke, but if they snuck tobacco in my shit somehow or did whatever, like it was just, it, it was, there's just so much more room for tolerance and forgiveness back in those days. Oh yeah, if you didn't smoke, I would have smoked and blew it in your face yeah, and, and make you like, and like I yeah. Be like, I'm a non-tobacco <laughs> user, you know? Mm -hmm. It would just be like, oh, fucking Joe, why'd you do that? these days. Yeah, but like, in this day and age. You know, the other thing is, we didn't have social media, so right. it's like, who cares, we got teased. You didn't teased. get humiliated on that level. Maybe like a yeah. couple of your friends that were around you saw Joe blow smoke in your face, but you didn't get like, Thousands of people yeah, seeing yeah, it yeah, on yeah. a public and space. You're like on reddit and now you're probably getting written articles about it. it's like yeah You gotta be you can't be a dick now. Yeah, I mean you can if you're still in one of those podunk towns that don't have a social following but True. Oh, that would ruin people. That's true <laughs> But I I don't know if I want to be <laughs> I don't, I don't know if I want to go to jail for all the kid shit that I did. Well, well good thing you didn't live in that all. era. Yeah True. And, you probably and, and wouldn't be doing it if you were in this era then. And you're seeing it happen around you and you're seeing the repercussions from all that shit. Too. I wouldn't have that kind of friends. You you said you were going to be that friend. Yeah, you were the friend. <laughs> <laughs> I'd be the friend that influenced other friends. I'd probably have the idea to give the vegan friend a chicken nugget. That's so funny. You should but be an influencer. <laughs> He's still an influencer, huh? <laughs> I am an influencer. Oh, there you go. Yeah. Wow. Imagine that. I just... I don't know. I'm just thinking about like that. all the shit that I did that I should have probably like gotten in trouble for, but it's like not a mark in my. It's karma. It's gonna yeah. come back to you. Don't you worry. Your kids, bro. Mm -hmm. oh, no, but like, like so. I don't know. You know, even even when we we're younger, like wedgies were a thing, or like I don't know, like. Uh, That's sexual uh, harassment. People walk, yeah, people walking yeah, around. That'd be, mm -hmm. Should that be assault? They, they go like yeah. Bangkok, and they just hit you in the nuts for no reason. And then, the, um, but nowadays, all these would be sexual harassment. Because you know? now you know better. Yeah. Because you know the mental repercussions, you know all the things that come along with I don't have any it. mental repercussions. Well, also, like, just, isn't know, it yeah. better? Like, you could make the argument, like, yeah, you know what? That made me stronger. Like, that was just joking. But, like, aren't we trying to move forward as a society to be better? Well, and if something I mean, makes someone feel better and not yeah. well, and othered. That people yeah. have thick skin because everyone's different. Right? Yeah, very like, thin skin. <laughs> you have thin skin. Yeah, like, you're sensitive and, you know what I mean? I'm just saying. I'm just saying we shouldn't brand kids so they live with this for the rest of their lives. They're college. They're These people are adults. They're, they're fucking assholes. Past college. They're 24. They're 24 is like four are years past pretty college. Pretty fucking stupid until they're 30. No way. Oh, they're so fucking stupid forever. <laughs> I still know so stupid yeah. fucking 50 year olds. I'm still stupid. I don't know what painters are. <laughs>